Hello my dear students, welcome you back in my geography class. I hope all of you are fit and fine. Today we are going to start with a new topic from the chapter 3 minerals and power resources for class 8. Now already in our earlier videos we have discussed about the minerals and what are minerals, what do you mean by rock and what are ores. We also came to know about the different types of minerals along with their characteristics. Now, we came to know about the definition of minerals, which are the different types of minerals and their characteristics. But the question that comes to our mind that how these minerals are extracted, what are the different processes by which we can obtain these minerals? Yes, you guessed it right. Today, our topic is extraction of minerals. So today, we will know about the different processes by which we can extract the mineral from the earth's surface. So without wasting much of our time, let's get started. There are mainly three processes by which we can extract the minerals. Extraction of minerals. which are the three processes by which we can extract the minerals. Number one, mining. Number two, drilling. And number three, wearing. Mining is subdivided into two types open cast mining and shaft mining so the extraction of minerals are carried out by three processes mining drilling and querying now let us know about mining drilling querying one by one what is mining Mining is referred as extraction of minerals from rocks buried under the earth's surface. We know that rocks are made of minerals that means aggregate of two or more minerals form the rocks right so we obtain the minerals from the rocks and these rocks where they lies they lies under the earth's surface so we extract the minerals from the rocks which are buried under the earth's surface and this process is referred as the mining now let us know about the two types of mining into which it is subdivided that is the open cast mining and the shaft mining. The open cast mining. Now, as we have learned that the extraction of minerals from rocks buried under the earth's surface is called mining. Now, the minerals or the rocks always do not lie near the surface. The minerals that lies at shallow depth now how we will extract these minerals we will extract these minerals by dugging out an open pit you can see this is a pit so by dugging out an open pit or borrow we will extract the minerals that means we are removing the earth's surface from an open pit or burrow and then we are taking out the minerals that is referred as the open cast mine so your minerals or rocks are taken out so what do you mean by open cast mining open cast mining means the extraction of minerals that lies at shallow depth 
by removing the earth surface from an open peat or borrow is known as the open cast mining. It is a surface mining technique. Now, when do we use this kind of method? We use this kind of method when minerals lies at shallow depth and also when the commercially useful ores or rocks are available near the earth's surface. Then we use the open cast mining method to extract this ores or rocks mainly which are the minerals that can be extracted with the process of open cast mining coal copper these are the common or we can say the main minerals which are extracted through the open cast mining now let us know about the shaft mining what is shaft mining shaft mining Every time the minerals are not available close to the surface. There are times when minerals are not available close to the surface. That means they do not lie near the surface. They are available at greater depth. In that case, we need to practice the shaft mining or the underground mining. What happens? The minerals are available at greater depth. Now to extract these minerals, what we have to do? We need to dug out deep bores or shafts. So deep bores or shafts has to be dug out So that the minerals can be taken out. These are the minerals which do not lie near the surface but they lie at greater depth. This is referred as a shaft mining or the underground mining. What is shaft mining? The mining in which deep bores called shafts have to be made to reach the minerals that lies at greater depths. So here we dug out the shafts or deep bores like this and then we go deep down to the earth's surface and we take out the minerals. Which are the minerals that are mostly taken out with the help of shaft mining like platinum, gold, diamonds. In South Africa, shaft mining is widely practiced. So that they can trick out this precious minerals right so with the help of shaft mining we can take out the minerals that lies at greater depth now let us know about the next process by which we can obtain the minerals that is drilling now there are certain minerals like petroleum and natural gas which occurs far below the earth's surface now how will we obtain those minerals which are available far below the earth's surface where in the bed of the ocean? The bed of the ocean, the minerals occurs far below in the earth's surface. Here to extract the minerals what we do? We dug out deep bores 
and with the help of deep bores we take out the minerals that is petroleum natural gas this process is known as the process of drilling so what do you mean by drilling deep wells are bored to take out the minerals from the bed of the ocean is called the process of drilling which type of minerals are taken out with the help of drilling petroleum and natural gas so these are the minerals which lies or which occurs in far below the earth surface uh, where we get it in the ocean bed so we need to dug out deep wells so that we can take out the minerals from the bed of the ocean we obtain the petroleum along with the petroleum we also obtain the natural gas it is a totally mechanized process and let me tell you this is very costly process by which we extract the petroleum and natural gas now let us know about the next process by which we can obtain the minerals that is the process of quarrying quarrying now let us know what you mean by quarrying the minerals that lies near the earth surface very near the earth surface what we do we simply dug out the minerals and this is called the process of querying so what is a query querying means querying means minerals that lies close or near to the surface are simply dug out or extracted from a query now what is a query query means see this one is a query this is what this is a type of open pit mine so now let us know what is a query a query means a type of open pit mine from where dimension stones rocks construction aggregates gravel are excavated from the ground so in simple terms we can say that a query means just by removing the ground by removing the stones rocks construction aggregates gravel we can utilize the ground and we can obtain or we can extract the minerals which lies very close to the earth surface so in this video what we discussed we discussed about the processes by which we can extract the minerals that is mining which is subdivided into open cast mining and shaft mining drilling and query i hope all of you understood these three important processes by which we can extract the minerals now what you will do you will read your books you will read in between the lines and also you will follow the pdf that has been already provided in the description box below if you have any suggestion or any problem you can just comment in the comment box given below if you like my video and my content and if you feel that it is worth watching do share it with your friends and don't forget to hit the like button if you have not subscribed yet and want to watch more videos on different topics do subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for further notifications of my upcoming videos 
stay tuned i will be back soon with a new video on a topic from this chapter that is distribution of minerals in the world till then take care and stay safe thank you